Ah, uh, hi, it's me, Invoice. Nice to see you. Hi, I am 500 subscribers, but I need to get a hundred, uh, a thousand subscribers so I can monetize. So, uh, 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 but I, I don't mind you with this. Hi, I'm Mink Voice. I'm a VTuber. <laughs> but let, let me tell you something really simple. Please subscribe. Like New York. D look at this graph. Look at this graph. I know people like graphs. I love graphs. Do you see it here? There's a problem. Yeah, thanks. That's the only problem I have. Please subscribe. I would very much love it. Please. Only guys, see please, must. I don't know. Okay. <laughs> so okay, today we have a, a, a super small video. It's two, two, two. Okay, it's two. It's two with this. It's 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 uh it's this one. It's Trump Biden and Obama make a Genshin Impact wife of Charlie's but limit frost. Uh yeah. <laughs> so let's hop to it. Hop to it like the Monster Hunter guy says. Okay, ready, steady. Go. Of course, how could I miss out on hanging out with the boys? Well, last time when I was. Hey, wait. Wow, oh, Murat, okay. You actually made it this time? Of course, how could I miss out on hanging out with the boys? Boys. Well, last time when I was streaming Genshin, you never showed up. Well, that's oh. because I was busy completing my weekly quests in Tower of Fantasy. I still can't get over the. Tower of Fantasy is six. Is it still six? You agree with what? Me, Joe? Joe is that? Um, Joe, are you there? This guy really lives up to that sleepy Joe nickname, huh? No! Anyways, let's just start without him. I'm sure he'll wake up as soon as I mention anything lolly related. Huh? I heard lollies. What happened? Joe, are you sure what? you're in a lolly con? Anyways, Is he? let's start already. I can already feel my attention span deteriorating by the second. Okay, but before okay. we start, I'm just going to put aside all the lolly characters. Excuse me, but I am heavily against that idea. Shut up, Joe. What? Shut up. No. Vegeta is over 500 years old. No. Now let's start with Aloy. D tier. D. D tier. No, no, no. no. Uh, D. Explanation. I agree with that one. Next we have Amber. The first character that we ever meet in Genshin. Got to be an easy S tier for me. Are you sure it's not because she looks young? No, isn't it obvious? It's no, because, because he's a good girl. The ages here, all right? None of the ages of these characters are confirmed, remember? Agreed. Aye. I place Amber in A tier. She's one of the characters I believe to have the best personality. I yes. This is not Oaklanda. I'll be honest, her forehead is even brighter than Joe's presidency. Shut your mouth, mm. Donald. At least I beat you in the 2020 elections. Okay, we need to speed things B. up here. Michelle's almost done baking me some lasagna, and I don't want to miss out on it. Oh, can I come over? No, you fat no. ass. <laughs> Ayaka. B. Looks kind of mid to me. I'd say B. I also agree. Now, Barbara. Oh, that reminds Oof. me. You guys heard of Barbara's curse removal? Curse removal? What? 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 A tier? Looks like a B tier to me. I agree it's with you. here. Seems pretty average. Nice singing, though. B tier it is. Now we have Beto. Easy S tier. I really believe with that pirate yeah. energy. Is it because you also do a lot of illegal things, Donald? What the hell, Joe? D tier for I, me. I'm in it's between, yeah. so I'm just going to place her in A tier. No! Wait, why is Diona on the list? S tier. What? D tier. Right. What? what? D tier, easily. Thoughts on Eula? Dummy thick waifu. S. Easy S tier. I agree. Queen. Guys do save lives. S yes, they say lives. Official next. D tier. Why? Is it oh? fall asleep listening to her paragraph long dialogues? Though her dialogue is long, this is I an interesting character with all the references she makes. B tier. Okay. Ganyu is next. S tier. S tier. No questions asked. <laughs> the literally the goat. Now we got yeah. <laughs> the best waifu in Genshin, and no one can tell me. Yes. Yeah. Who? What do you mean, who? Asked. Who child? Joking aside, easy S tier. Now that's a good one, Joe. Jean is next up on the list. Serious waifu material. A. S tier. I disagree. This guy really gonna diss all the talk. Because he's so simple. It's just preferences, Barack. Never heard of that before. Well, your preferences kind of suck, not gonna lie. Oh. Let's just leave it as A tier and move on. Kishing is next. Now this cat girl mm, Kishing is first waifu when I first started this game and forever will be. S tier. Plus, she yes. also got one of the best selections of fan art on Pixiv. I can what? agree with that. And now look at that. Klee is next. Easy S tier. Oof. No. I no. Say D tier, but I kind of like those jumpty dumpties. Kind of reminds me D. of the airstrike. Oh, not you too, Barack. I'm putting her in D tier. No questions. Sounds good. Yeah. Fair. Now we got Lisa. Probably the worst waifu on this list. D tier for sure. What? Oh, here he goes again. The fact that she's a little bit is kind mean, of boring. boring. Almost makes me want to doze off, you know? Of course, no. you know, find her boring. Not sure what I expected, honestly. But honestly speaking, though, she does lack a little compared to those in S tier and A tier. Yeah, I know. 
I agree. Vitya. Here we have Mona. Speaking of Mona, you guys ever seen Mona X? Vitya. Oh, not this again, Donald. I may not have seen it, but now you have piqued my interest. Looks decent, though. I give it A tier. A tier she goes then. A tier. Looks like Ning Guang is next. S tier, no doubt about it. Mm. Is it because she's rich? I think it's more because she knows how to build a wall. Isn't that right, Don? Couldn't have said <laughs> it better myself. Seems kind of mid to me, though. Well, see, ask too much for us. On this one. I'll compromise B. and place her in B tier. Noel, another S tier. Surely you guys B. agree with me, right? Well, yeah. I do agree with you. She does lack the screen time and personality compared to all the other S tiers. I'll yeah. I'll place her in C tier. I'm in the middle. I'd say B tier. B tier it is, then. Now on to Chi Chi. S tier. D. Seriously, what is with you and your lowly complex? Why? When he has the lolly complex, like why? Moving on. Now we have Rosaria. I kind of missed pre-nerf Rosaria. What Oof. happened? She's got more changes to her character, more times than Sleepy Joe's had in his diaper. She lost Buba and us. Okay, that was a bit uncalled for Barack, I'm putting her in B tier. Okay, here we have Shen He. Now she's the true S. definition of the quote. <laughs> Looks too old for me. If pray away hard. More like your no. opinion on this is D tier. Barack, put her in S tier. Agreed. Now we have Sucrose. As sweet as she is, I think Sucrose lacks a bit of character, mm. at least from what I'm seeing. I agree with Donald on this one. Feels is, like this pretty brilliant, is this pretty the the event with Windflame or not? But I can understand the low rating. I'll put her in C tier for now. C tier. Looks like we have Xiangling next. Very mid. B. Nothing really stands out from her character other than her ability to cook. Agreed. Though Goba does make this character a lot more interesting. We're only looking at the character, remember? Pets don't count. Did you pets. seriously just call Goba a pet? Anyway, she's going into B tier. Now we have Xinyan. I think she deserves to be at least B tier considering her backstory and Now such. wait a minute, I don't want some Antifa looking gal anywhere above it's C tier. It's B. What the hell, Donald? I'm putting her in See, B tier. It's more screen time. L move there, Barack. We're almost done with Mondstadt and Liwei. Here's Yan Fei. Oh, Biden is gonna love A tier. Character. A lawyer who can save you from any case. Shut up, Donald. You're pointing <laughs> fingers at the wrong person. Can we all agree <laughs> that she goes into A tier? Agreed. Yeah. Same. We now have Yao Yao next. But I'm D. just going to put her into D tier. But I didn't even get a chance to... I don't want D. to hear another word from you, Joe. Now on to Yolan. <laughs> she's peak waifu material. S. And she's also got that strong dog mommy energy, too. I, for once, agree to that. Just admit that you guys want her to step on you already. <laughs> yes. Honestly speaking, though, I feel the same. I knew yeah. it. Yeah. S tier it is. Last but step not on least, me. we got Yun Jin. Easiest S tier of my life. Is it because she's strong and resembles China? A tier. No. Well, anyways, I'm just going to put her in B tier just to quickly. No. Called me to go eat. Oh, are you sure you don't want to invite me along as well? Yeah, what about us? Maybe next time when we finish this tier list. I got to let her know to make more next time, okay? Oh. Same meeting time next week? Works for me. For sure. I'm going to end the call now. Have a good night, you two. Love you guys. Love oh. you guys, too. No homo, though. No homo, though. Okay, part two. I've been thinking. What is it? You know those Genshin Impact body pillows? I kind of want to get one. Well, I know they definitely oh, help you with getting to sleep. Speaking from experience, of course. Not surprising and coming from you, but on that note, what cover did you pick for yours? For me? <laughs> I mean, what? What are you going to pick for your design? Joe, you better answer that damn question before I call the cops on you. Only in my case. Being late again, oh, dear. I was on that grind again for Tower of Fantasy. I swear, Barack. The day you stop playing that dead ass game is the day where Joe finally stops obsessing over lollies. What? I'll be playing this game right up until my deathbed. You guys are getting the wrong idea as always. Anyways, we're getting a bit off topic. We're here to okay. to this tier list. We've only got waifus from Inazuma and Sumeru left to do. But before yeah. we move on, is there any characters you guys want to swap around before we begin? I still think it's a crime that Noelle didn't get placed in S tier. Like I said last time, she just lacks personality and screen time. Looks like mm. to me that you guys never played or hangout events. People actually play the hangout events. Sorry, Donald, but hangouts are probably one of the most boring type of content Oof. there is. I'll take from I haven't played it. She'll still remain as an S tier in my heart forever. Donald's starting to kind of sound like your average Noel fanboy. Shut it. Oh. <laughs> All right, I'll move her to A tier because in terms of a waifu perspective, a hardworking maid doesn't seem too bad after all. Finally, oh. someone with common sense. Okay, anyone else? What about Lisa? I know there are some Lisa simps out there molding. Yeah. I still stand by my opinion on Lisa being the worst waifu on this list. No. To some extent, I agree with Joe here. While she is charming, I don't think her character is fleshed out enough to merit a higher rating. 
I didn't really think about it too hard about my decision last time, but isn't being attractive, flirtatious, and caring all great mm. points on being a great waifu? She has to be at least A tier, right? You do have a fair point. I'll play yeah. in the middle and settle with B tier then. All right, anyone else? You know, you have wife after here, yo. playing around with the Windbloom Festival, I kind of feel like I want to move up Sucrose to at least Oh. I actually just finished that event yesterday and I totally agree oh, with it. Yeah, that was saying the wind blend event. And sucrose were something we don't always get to see very often. I haven't even started that event yet. Of course you'd be sleeping on that event. No surprises <laughs> there. All right, sounds like we're in agreement okay. to put sucrose in B tier then. I still don't really get it, but all right. Speaking of Windbloom, that brings us to the first character on this list, Kali. Uh -huh. Well, I don't oh. see her as waifu material. She certainly deserves the high Stop rating, yeah. seeing as what she's gone through. Rarely do it's I agree with Donald here, but for once I do. She needs to be protected. Very much agree with that statement. You can definitely see some character growth coming from that Windbloom event. Yeah. Therefore, I'll put her in A tier. Next, we have Candace. Who's Candace again? Who? Who? <laughs> Who is Candace? You know, I feel like it's such an overused joke that I'm not even no, no, no. say it. No, seriously, who? I don't remember who that character was. Honestly, though, Biden does have a point. She's not a very memorable character as she doesn't really have any defining characteristics. Her yeah. character kind of resembles Lisa somewhat, but doesn't really have much else going for her. I'd I haven't seen her yet. Because she's got that strong mommy vibe going for her. I'll place her yeah. in B tier then. And now on to one of the more controversial characters. S. Dea. I don't care what people say, but Dea will always be S tier in my book. Weren't you the S -S person who told me to not summon for Dea like three weeks ago? I may not like her gameplay, but her design and story <laughs> quest really does hit. Her me. gameplay sucks. But her design is top tier. One of the best waifus. S tier. Agreed. Now so you can't get your ass. Wait a D. Second. You heard that right, Barack? Yeah. Joe didn't place a lolly into S tier for once. Now I don't know how old she is, but she reminds me of my late grandmother. Well, this is one of the lolly characters. I had time for Kave, but that's the only thing I have. Dicha. Oh my god, I know you guys haven't played the game out quest yet, but I urge all of you guys to try it. That one ending is just chef's kiss. I'll consider it. I mean, I already like her design right off the bat, and her design very closely resembles that Miku character, right? Ah, yes. Hatsune Miku. Yeah. That reminds me of the time when I played Project Sakai just last week. I remember specifically. Oh. Uh, getting that 100% accuracy. Now, let's not get off topic here. Okay? Yeah. We're here for the tier. Hatsune Miku. Salty that you can never reach my level, Donald. So are we eh. in agreement in placing her at A tier? Definitely. Yeah. Did you guys seriously just ignore me? Now we have yes. Kokomi. I always knew it. You remember how she crashed on ever since she came out? Now look at what happened. He's not Kokomi S because reasons. Top tier unit. Yeah, I was a meta player back then, too. I followed what those YouTubers said and skipped her first banner. Ah. Kokomi is as basic as they come. No meaningful character or personality. She's about as oh. deep as Kitty's pool. Can't go a day without mentioning kitties and pools now, can't we, Joe? You're missing the oh. point. She may be somewhat basic, but isn't she also one of the most wholesome characters out there, too? Well, yeah. I say She's completely wholesome. wholesome as she keeps a secret diary about the Traveler, remember? Stop the Captain what? fanfics, Joe. I still think she fanfics. deserves to be in C tier, though. Nah, I still a, 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 a. what I say. Gotta give her A tier. But in a waifu perspective, I'd still give her an A tier, so that's where I'll put her. Oh, this is A tier. Up next is Cujo a tier. Star. Objectively speaking, Cujo is clearly superior in terms of being a strategist compared to Kokomi. That and plus, she's also pretty strong in lore. She's a bird. I forgot her most important trait: her loyalty to the raid and show. No, really she's she a bird. A strong <laughs> sense of commitment. I think that merits her into being a high A tier, if not S tier. A tier. I'd say S tier, but A tier doesn't sound too bad either. Looks like A tier. A -tier. Is. Now we have Kuki Shinobu. I know she's S. not a lolly, but I gotta give her S tier. I think you S, all yeah. can understand why. Yeah, the fact that she's all right she and babysitting the Arataki gang says a lot about her character. That's she it! She babysits them! Duty. She will make sure your room is clean and let you know when to take your meds. Isn't yeah. Right, Joe? Um, when am I supposed to take those again? Frequently, Joe. Frequently. Frequently. <laughs> to put her in S tier? Yeah. S tier. Now on to Layla. Layla's about as much of a snooze fest as one of Joe's speeches. Oh! Is Joe going to give her an S tier? As much as I relate to her, I just don't see myself that invested in this character. I'm a little bit surprised by Joe here, but I agree. She doesn't even get a hangout quest, so we can't really know too much about her unless you read her lore. Mm. At least her demo music is a banger, right? That's literally all the demo trailers out there, Barack. All of them are <laughs> bangers. I guess that's true. Yes. So what rank are we placing her then? Let's C. place her into C tier for now. 
Agreed. For now, now until we get a complete Hyang Kanga quest of like her. Good Lord, slap a purple wig on me along with a sombrero and call me Scaramouche because that is my mommy. Oh, hell no. He's going too far. I'd suggest placing her into double S tier. <laughs> no! S tier, let alone double S tier. No! Do you guys think she's cute and funny? And no! The cunny. All right, we need to lock this man. Haven't you guys ever had a DTR? No, <laughs> because he's a waifu, she's kid. This is a waifu tier list, and she's still a lolly. She's going into D tier. Yeah, you're not fooling her, yeah. Joe. You guys just don't understand. FBI so open up. This is Nilu, and I truly believe that Nilu is considered peak waifu material. More like peak, peak waifu dog material. Shit. Yeah. As much as I love her design, she's as stale as Joe's banana bread. Hey, oh. Mom, you know, I, I put a lot of effort into making that. If you worked in a cardboard manufacturing plant rather than taking the spot as president, then sure. Are you serious, Donald? I'm as serious as Nilu's determination to keep what the sub Saru's festival. Whoa there, Donald. But what about her dancing? Well, that's the only thing she can do and the only thing she did do during that Archon quest. Look, oh. Like here had a lot to get off his plate on Nilu. But despite all that, I'd still place her in A tier because her fan art on Don Baru strikes me as S tier. What? Alright, can cook? D. That is correct, Donald. Therefore, we'll have to place her in S tier. Oh God! Now that's another. No, D tier. I can't believe you put all the lollies into D tier. Biden is actually the definition of the quote. Tell me you're a lollycon without telling me you're a lollycon. Yeah. Oh, God, you know what they say. If her age is on the clock, then she's ready for the Okay, someone seriously needs to put this guy <laughs> in the therapy. <laughs> both of your pillows are warm on both sides tonight. We're almost done with the list. We now have Yemiko. Another Donald S. Mommy. Easy S tier. Donald. S tier. Just because she is a fox doesn't mean she watches Fox News. She's a kitsune, you uncultured swine. It's the same yeah. thing, you Cheeto puff looking ass. You guys are forgetting uh. the most important thing about Ye Miko. And what is that? Ye Miko's feet pics are truly exceptional and can only what? be reserved to be placed in S tier. Tough to argue with that one. Now Barack gets it. Last but not least, we have Yoimiya. Not gonna oh. lie, Yoimiya really does rock the crust out of my knee high socks. Oh. And I didn't hear that. But for real though, looking past Joe's weird statements, she's probably one of the best candidates for being a waifu. She's extremely yeah. likable and cheerful. Don't forget the booba bandages though. And the fact oh. that she can make explosives. Of course you'd be into the explosives part, Barack. So we're in agreement to place her in S tier? Absolutely. S -tier. And now that concludes our list on all the waifus in Genshin Impact. Yeah! Thanks again for joining me on creating this list. Wait! I still can't there's no one missing! Where's Kawei? Kawei's a fucking waifu too because he's a baby girl. <laughs> you letting Nahida sit in D tier. It was fun, Barack. So what are we gonna do now? Speaking of what to do, why don't we all come over to my place for some spaghetti and meatballs? I specifically oh. told Michelle to make extra today. Sounds like a plan. And maybe we can even discuss on what our next tier list should be about. I've heard that the Fatui Harbingers are a hot topic right now, so maybe we can Oof. talk about that. Sounds perfect. I'll see you all in half an hour then. All right. See you guys soon. Peace out, homie. Oh. Tell me why I'm here and what's the... Ah. <laughs> oh. I love it. To be honest, I love this. I really like this because it's really funny. Um. Uh, Let's let's be honest. It's really 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 fun. To be honest, it's it's really 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 fun. I will say top tier. Some of the S tiers are true. I will put Raiden Shagun A tier. Don't kill me, please. But she cannot cook, and I cannot cook either. So it will be a nightmare if we were together. <laughs> you know, <laughs> get get someone who can cook. <laughs> was a wife. Was a husband. Like okay. <laughs> Okay, so thank you everyone for coming. Uh, see you next uh, video. Uh, take care. Bye. Bye. Adiosito. Ciao. Love y'all.